Today I'm going to be taking a look at this brand new 2015 model Clarion NX605. This is the current model which replaces the NX604 from last year which was their first time they brought out their smart access all-in-one GPS navigation system. So this 605 is basically the same unit because I'm going to say, use, say that because I'm going to use this kind of like as a trailer. So I'm going to go over this. I'm going to show you the front, the back, the details, some of the main generalities and specifications and everything that makes this model new. But I'm also going to show you a link back to the NX604. So if you want to get into the advanced settings and all the, the, the stuff that goes on behind the scenes and how to adjust the settings, the screens, the functionalities, the, the, all those minute little features, I cover that in extreme detail in the NX604 review. So I'll show you a link for that. But of course, I'm going to show you everything that's new and everything that needs to be talked about for this NX605 and why this one is worth your attention. So first off, this is the flagship model. So if you're looking for an all-in-one 7-inch from Clarion, it's not gonna, you're not going to find it. It seems to be a lot of manufacturers are doing that. Why the reason is for that, I don't know. But when I find that, I'll sure be happy to tell you because I, I like to know for my own self. Now, Clarion's exclusive intelligent voice technology, which utilizes Google and again, Clarion is the only manufacturer who has a partnership directly with Google. So while a lot of other manufacturers are just specifically gearing towards the Apple and being more Apple and Apple orientated, this one, while it does play nicely with the Apple iPhone products, is really geared, in my opinion, more for the Android user. It's, again, because it is a Google-driven product, and of course Google does not work with Apple, so that kind of says it all. And that's cool. So. This thing, using the Google's intelligent voice, which I might also add, aside from the NX604 last year, it is an advanced version of the Google connectivity, so that way when you're using it for the navigation guidance, you have Google search, and you can enable that using information using the Google Calendar and Gmail account directly from your phone for navigation and communication purposes. So it's all different. So instead of being choppy and disorientated saying, please find me an Italian restaurant, you could say, I'm hungry, where can I eat? Say stuff that is just normal and fluent, just like you would talk to your tablet or your Android at home. Same kind of thing applies to your car stereo. So the way it's supposed to work is that you're supposed to use the, the unit more wirelessly just by using the, the button right here, the smart access microphone button. When you have something on your mind that you want to do something, you want to read your text messages, check your email, you want to hear the weather, which again, in this model, the NX605, it has the RDS TMC feature built right into it. So you have an unlimited feature for traffic, live traffic, and weather built right into the unit. So aside from just the Google um, stuff, getting it directly from your data plan and your telephone, this unit within its own self with this new antenna and old setup that's in there will give you the, the GPS tracking. Um, traffic update alerts, traffic conditions, all that stuff right on, right upon itself. You don't need to pay for anything. You don't need to update anything. It just does its thing, and that's awesome. And it has, they boast, over 11 million POIs. Of course, I haven't counted, but that's what they say. They say the NX605 is equipped with the superior built-in nav system, features additional industry-leading capabilities like the RDS TMC tuner with real-time traffic information from that system, and that's really something, and they're really pushing that innovation. So, and if innovation is what you're looking for, this is the unit for you because a lot of the other manufacturers out there are just making more things that go beep, boop, 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 boop and making more pretty lights. That's what not what Clarion's all about. Clarion is about innovating, making stuff that's more user friendly and consumer driven, I think. And I, that's what I see, and, and I kind of agree with it. So, Clarion's for N NX605, I'll buy that. As far as what you see aesthetically from last year's, I can't tell any difference. Smart card access right there, 3.5 millimeter um, access jack right there. In the rear, which I'm going to show you, is where your um, all your adaptive settings for your HDMI and USB uh, cables are, and that's cool. That's the way I like it. Your rotary knob, because a lot of users like that. You have your quick select icons for your main menu screen, which is all the way it's always been. This is nothing different. The way you see it. Last year, and what you're accustomed to with, with Clarion is not changing. It's all these features are all laid out exactly in the same way. Single touch for your GPS, back and forth. Very straightforward. I like it. They did also some, some minor advances, like I noticed in the um, audio settings, which is where I spend a lot of my time looking when I see any unit. That's the first place I look. Actually, let me go here. And you can see you got the intelligent tune, the graphic EQ, which 
thank goodness they finally got on board with that because that's what they sh they've been lacking for years. They had that with last year. They kept it this year. So go Clarion with all that stuff. Let me show you the back side of this unit now. All right, so here we are. We're looking at the back side of the NX605. Right over here, you have your GPS antenna, which is a little bit smaller, I, I think. I didn't pull out the NX604 or 60 anything else to compare it, but I'm pretty good. I mean, I can remember. This one looks a little bit smaller, so that's an improvement. We like that. Over here, you have a jack for your steering wheel interface. If you want to tie it into a Maestro system or if you're going to tie it into your hardwired steering wheel controls, that's how you do that. Analog antenna receptacle right there. You have four volt preamp outputs. Uh, video in, video out right here, front, rear, and sub, respectively. Over here, this green plug, that there is for the Clarion's proprietary camera. So if you need to add a camera, you're going to need to utilize their proprietary technology for that feature. And of course, it has, you know, the turn-on mode and the necessary reverse uh, cable here. So it'll trigger the camera on while you're in reverse. And of course, you could tr trigger it on by the main mode on the screen. Of course, it has dual zone capabilities. You could do that. Plus your Bluetooth, your camera, all that stuff within itself without any external parts. Over here, there's a jack there for the S Sirius XM SXV300, which is a replacement of the 200. So the 100 is out of the game. Nobody uses that anymore. So the SXV200, 300, same cable, but it'll, it'll proprietarily work with the 300 model, which is advanced. It gives you more information. The text is laid out. It's much more nicer than it's ever been. On the bottom, you have the supplied USB extension cable. Right next to it, there's a plug for your HDMI interface. Over here is for your Bluetooth microphone, which they supply with some extra little goodies so you can mount it on a visor or on a dash, however you want to do it. They also supply you with this trim ring, owner's manual on disc, so the days of the big Bible are gone. And of course you have the regular installation guide guaranteed, all that kind of stuff. I mean, that's pretty much it. So I'm going to review you over to the NX604 review if you want to get the in-depth operation and functionality of this system. Take a look at that. But for here, that's what I have to say about your 2015 model Clarion NX605. <laughs>